Hello, this is Nisha's Dream World, and today I am going to make a perfect Wali art for the beginners. So let's get started. So hello and welcome back to my channel again, Nisha's Dream World, and today we are going to do something really different than we do uh, the every day. As every day there is something like um modern, and uh, you can say like. We didn't do anything traditional. So today we are going to do Wali painting or Wali art. Um, I don't have any paints. I just have two white color pens. So it's not a need to have two pens. My one is going to finish. So that's why I have one for need. So first upon for Wali painting, uh, Wali art, I'm going to use a pen, white pen. It's uh, just like approximately this one is of 70 and uh, the other one this is of 50 so there are many more such uh, cost of white pens now um first of all i'm going to tell you that it's not necessary to make wildly art with the pen you can also use brushes or paints i will uh, try to make another video such like this of how to use paints to make wildly art so now let's get started first of all i'm going to make a border like after keeping a little bit distance like this let's just use the sides just perfectly cut it okay this looks I'm making a mark at my scale and now we are going to just mark everywhere distance we are going to uh, use like we have done like this from this side now we are going to do from here so like I made a point now make such points everywhere so we are going to make uh, the patterns or the border with the help of the uh, barley pa patterns like we do uh, it will get more attractive and uh, if we just make a simple border it will be look so simple like um, so to attract the drawing so we have to make such borders it will make a little bit more interest in the drawing and it will look like it's in the from the old age or like Wadley art is simple and it's like old or uh, we can not say like old but in the olden days they were used for wall designings so when they were used to make wall designs the particular part was like uh, scaled or we can say just like bordered so that's why we are going to make such border at the page uh, page like the same so it looks more decent or like more nice So now I'm done with the lines like this. This paper is of A4 size and like uh, I've cut it in. There's uh, you can just buy such. This is a tender paper. You can just take a big one which is for just 15 rupees and uh, then you can cut it into just A4 size.
so now i'm going to start making triangles by side by side um, just take a example or take a particular size in your mind that you should take only this much size not more or not less and the height too in between we have to just take a line and then we have to make a dot so it's like so simple then we have to continue this line So here I am done with the border entirely. First of all at this side at the down side this edge we are going to make a woman. And uh, first of all, I'm just making made a circle, and then I'm making a line. Then we have to make a triangle. Like this. Then again, triangle to the opposite side. Like a uh, water reflection. It should be like this and then we are going to make legs it's like this now then we are going to make um her hair like this we are going to make a boy or a girl or a kid we can say sitting at the back side holding her or but first of all let's make just a hand i think the kids shouldn't be there because it's a little bit hard to merge them for the beginning just make a woman and now we are going to make a hen right here. Make this see border. So here's one thing is done. So now I just model uh, or make a drawing of a sheep, which is similarly a little bit like a human, but the the same or something like the similar uh, similarance is like it has the triangles at the stomach part which uh, a human also has so we just have to make two triangles 
legs yeah at this side and there's like four legs at this part and this part and then we have to make a tail and face like this so like now i'm going to color this oh, entire um triangles we are going to make more two ships like this and one shepherd as uh, in olden days uh, the things they used to see or the images or the imagination they used to see uh, was like uh, there's a shepherd herd or some people are grazing the sheep or they are farming like that first upon uh, i'm going to make a farm at this side at the middle part like to just make some lines and some dots like see just move your hand with the pen and done it's the most simple part wali pa uh, paintings are more harder uh, because uh, there we use brushes for that sometimes we just like move our brush if we move our brush too much longer then it gets like too much dirty or sometimes it gets um, in a wrong way so that's why i'm using um, a pen but if you are a artist or if you want to be like start from the paints itself then start making the simple part like for the only women's or men's and then uh, something like that part nowadays sunset is uh, sunset back side and at the front there are people of uh, varli that's also the simplest part varli art is my favorite uh, because it's uh, too simple to make and also it looks too neat and tidy as well as the paintings which are harder but relaxing varli it doesn't take too much of um, time to make and now i'm just making a little bit grass everywhere i'm just taking a look from upside it's just it's just looking cool and amazing let me show you uh i'm just starting it and uh, like it started getting a uh, nice and better looking only a little bit at the upper side now this is the last layer i'm making a uh, 1 2 3 4 4 rows of um, like farm done and uh, the farm is done now it's pretty simple and the ship is also done we are going to make more ships here let me just show you so again i am just uh, draw the same like i did this let's color it so most of you guys will have some questions like um, after making this what should we do of this so we can just uh, make a um, table plate like the background like this is the paper just take a plastic cover and wrap it not like the file one uh, just wrap it and then uh, like table tops or like we can just keep it like water glasses on it and then on the plates of glass we can just receive it so they can also get to know how, how creative we are so now i am making some grass here and at this side i am going to make a old man of a, i mean a shepherd a old sheep old man shepherd or something like that but we are going to make him a little bit bent so it should the line should be a little bit 
ब्रांडेड so this is a big stick actually it is not looking like a old man but it's okay <laughs> so now half of our uh, part is done let's just make the sun and uh, we are going to make a hut here first upon this make some people who are collecting the grass or like the thing which is what can i say um the fields or the grasses which are dried so they can graze the, the animals so like we are going to make it the upper part of this farm so this we have to make it a little bit slanting so these should be women's So the half of part is done. Now I'm going to make a sun. First of all, make I'm going to make a round and border that round. Then I'm going to make some triangles. So like sun rays are of um, such shapes. When children used to draw sun, in the same way we are going to make. But this is wadi art, and there is like doodle art. <laughs> Actually, most of the children still makes wadi arts. Like stick man is a kind of wadi art. simplest thing to make in wali art is like um a man a woman and a farm the hardest thing in the wali art is like making temples uh like um, some god or like every different thing so now i'm going to make some uh, dots uh, and i just i'm just telling you right this grass is made for showing that there is land or like uh, sometimes it is seen like they are walking in the sky or flying in the sky <laughs>
It's like I'm done with the sun now. <coughs> now we are going to make a hut here. For that I'm going to make a little bit land. And like this paper is of A4 size. If your paper is a little bit bigger, you can just make some trees and etc. etc. <laughs> Just search it on Google and you will get some ideas like these. So my entire pen is going to waste at this art. I am just make a ground. As the old people you means and the olden. What we can say days they were like having some ground space or they were just using or uh, used to make some uh, increase the height of their houses in this way and the second most hard part of the house is the uh, means part of the valley art is the house so like this is the backup or like grid for the hut like I'm done a little bit only a little bit grass because in the olden days the houses were also made of the grass so more and more part is done by the lines I'm just changing the pen because that one is not working neatly. Now I'm making a st stairs or like the olden days stairs like this and then uh, my half of work is done but like the uh, for the place of shep uh, sheep there is a wooden thing something like this So now the hut is also done. If you want to make some trees or uh, something like coconut trees, you can just make it at this side. On let's make clouds. I'm feeling like I'm making ships here. <laughs> it's a similar feeling. Because ships also have such kind of hairs. I'm done. So here's the simplest uh, Wali art for the beginners. As you can just 
take a look our uh, entire body art is like so simple and so easy if you want to make some grass as this side because there's too much less grass here you can just make like this so simply so now our wali art is done it's just so simply done like this part is done by just making the lines so easily and then this part is also some uh, done by like the same part which we did for the hood just making lines and lines and then dots and dots this part is little bit understanding so you should watch how to make hen and how to make the woman so now i'm done with this manda uh, sorry wali art like i always do the mandala arts in this video uh, in uh, on this channel so i just decided to just change the topic today and start making wali videos like uh, actually the reason why i'm making wali art is like my father wants to decorate a wall uh, to make wali and then i'm just trying to practice it so that's why i'm just going to make more such arts and i have a big piece of uh, such brown paper it's just for 15 rupees buy your tinted paper now and just like start making your wali arts